Wisdom, the final frontier to true knowledge. Welcome to Wisdom Trek, where our mission is to create a legacy of wisdom, to seek out discernment and insights, to boldly grow where few have chosen to grow before. Hello, my friend. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, your captain on our journey to increase wisdom and to create a living legacy. Thank you for joining us as we explore wisdom on our second millennium of podcast. This is day 1007 of our trek, and it is time for our three-minute mini trek called Humor Unplugged. Our Thursday podcast will provide you with a clean and short funny story to help you to lighten up and live that rich and satisfying life something to cheer you and provide a bit of levity to your life. We are told in Proverbs chapter 15, verse 30, a cheerful look brings joy to the heart. Good news makes for good health. We are also encouraged in Proverbs chapter 17, verse 22, a cheerful heart is good medicine, but a broken spirit saps a person's strength. Consider this your vitamin supplement of cheer for today. So let's jump right in with today's funny, which is titled, Diving in head first. John and Sam are out hunting, and as they were walking along, they came upon a huge hole in the ground. They approached it with caution and are amazed at the size of it. Sam says, Wow, that's some hole. I can't even see the bottom. I wonder how deep it is. John turns to him and says, I don't know. Let's throw something down there and listen and see how long it takes to hit the bottom. Sam looks around and says, Hey, there's an old automobile transmission over there. Give me a hand and we'll throw it in and see. So John and Sam pick up this heavy transmission and carry it over to the hole. They swing it back and forth a couple times and then count. One, two, three, and heave it into the hole. As they were standing there listening, looking over the edge, they suddenly heard a loud rustling behind them. They quickly turned around and they see this goat come crashing through the underbrush, run up to the hole, and without hesitation, jump in head first. While they were standing there staring at each other in amazement, trying to figure out what that was all about, an old farmer saunters up. Say there, says the farmer, you fellows didn't happen to see my goat around here anywhere, did you? John says, funny you should ask, but we were just standing here a minute or two ago, and this goat came running out of the bushes doing about a hundred miles an hour and jumped headfirst in this here hole. The old farmer said, Nah, that's impossible. I had him chained to a transmission. Well, I hope that brought a smile to your face today. Our Thursday thought for today is taken from Proverbs chapter 30, verse 29 through 31. There are three things that walk with stately stride, no four that strut about. The lion king among animals who won't turn aside for anything, the strutting rooster, the male goat, and a king as he leads his army. Just as you enjoy these nuggets of humor, please encourage your friends and family to join us and then come along with us tomorrow for another day of Wisdom Trek, Creating a Legacy. If you'd like to listen to any of the past 1,006 treks or read the wisdom journals, they are all available at wisdom-trek.com. I encourage you to subscribe to Wisdom Trek on Apple Podcasts or Google Podcasts so that each day's trek will be downloaded to you automatically. And thank you so much for allowing me to be your guide, your mentor, but most importantly, I am your friend as I serve you through the Wisdom Trek podcast and journal each day. And as we take this trek of life together, let us always live abundantly, love unconditionally, listen intentionally, Learn continuously, lend to others generously, lead with integrity, and then leave a living legacy each day. I am Guthrie Chamberlain, reminding you to keep moving forward, enjoy your journey, and then create a great day every day. It's your choice. See you tomorrow for Philosophy Friday.